Just looking for any kind of aggressive push that's not coming whatsoever just yet. Base played a very aggressive game yesterday against G2. His opening pissed around much slower paced. A lot of space given over to NIP, and that can be tough to deal with. Nice smoke. Oh, simple with the opening kill of the series. Perfecto with a quick follow-up, and there's no way through that. Doesn't really matter how many flashbangs you're going to be throwing through that one. There's three people on the other side with blocks, so you're not coming through. It's... It's a well-known Navi plan. <laughs> yeah, it's a good tactic. Rinse and repeat, they go back to it. Hiroki's just trying to survive. Nice shot there on both SDY and Simple. Rain is the last one left, but no reason for him to move forward at all. Preserve the armor if you can. But also, I mean, FaZe hasn't exactly looked perfect either. I don't know, this is like, if there's ever a trap game to lure you into picking FaZe and losing faith in Navi and having them just come out, come out and just bust FaZe open in this series, this would be the one. Yeah, I picked FaZe as well, and I don't feel good about it at all. But that's also partly because it's it feels... We've all seen Simple win. Yeah, it's not impossible. And he's super confident, so he, he's not thinking about, I think, missing a shot. I think he's just gonna... This isn't a commitment. I think they're gonna go out mid. They just want to have a distraction here. There's gonna be the smoke up. Information yeah. is being called out by FaZe to go out mid, and two quick kills from Pit and Perfecto. 20 seconds. Oh, now no. you don't got any time to be slow if you're Electronic and Navi. Uh, not at all. Oh, I think they might lose this round anyway. Rops is at the back of the bomb site. 14 seconds right now. Out long. It's SDY. Comes. Oh, and tries to get the kill, but here's the big problem. Oh no. Seven seconds left. Running with the knife out with the bomb. And he's. No! He's, I don't think he has it. Yeah. It's too late. Navi, please. It's okay. It's it's the, one of those things you're, you have to know if you're this team. That has to be the conversation with Electronic coming in. Look, there's going to be a couple of these rounds. 42 seconds on the clock. Brokey's going to jiggle. Electron oh, my lord. That is just poor timing with the jiggle. Nothing Brokey really did wrong there except not have a blind timing. Flashbang over the top. Molotov is going to prevent any kind of a peek from Twist. Excuse me. He stands in the flames for one. Four on four. Rain is close up on Catwalk. There's the peek from Electronic to clean up the kill. Yep. A lot of trouble for Rops once again. He's out of nades. He can't buy any more time. He's going to have to take a lot of fights. Electronic is traded in the middle, but it's still all on Rops. And look at the time again. 13 seconds here. Rain is there. And Rops with a headshot. And they've done enough here. Eight seconds. Sundar Young trying to get the fight. And he's... Oh, he's going to get the last two kills. I thought surely Rain would have been able to stay out of that. Yeah, that and I think Rain is just, I mean, look, there's so much pressure being put on. Rain's just getting over and trying to save the day, and he does a great job. Maybe just peaks a little early. Maybe should have let Rops take contact, but how can you know? Especially after you already had the fight against Simple. And it wasn't the Electronic who exited first. It was some Dai Young went down right afterwards. Molotov out, spray, and he's standing inside of the fire. Friendly smoke to put it out, and that's super helpful. Brokey goes down, but Robs is going to fight Bit on the other side, and he'll win that in the middle. Not bad. Four versus three. It's going to be <laughs> Kerrigan first to take contact, I think. Electronic is thinking about it. He is. He's got a Molotov. Oh, he makes it past, and that's one hell of an opening. Perfecto on the follow-up to take down Kerrigan with a Molotov behind him. He could never escape. Well, that's a little bit of a double knee down there, but who really cares at this point in time? Again, look at the clock when they get that bomb down. Not a lot can go wrong in the execution of this. Don't have any nades or anything like that, and no kit currently picked up, so might get very, very tricky. Trying for the boost. They know where both are after that. Rain goes down. Nice headshot. It's a very... Quick shot coming out from Simple, but twist a little bit faster. Gonna stick around and try and make it maybe a little bit more expensive. I don't think he can win the round any longer, and Perfecto will take him down. And Navi, that is a... The right idea, hold the right angle, or jiggle peek into a position and just have a mistiming with when the peek actually comes. And I mean, you gotta give credit over to Navi there. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. <laughs> Add a little bit on top. Making it very hard for FaZe to activate some of these players. Yeah, they're dictating everything right now, which is absolutely disgusting. By the way, at some point if we should get a we should get a replay of from from like a third person view of that swing from electronic because that needs to be in like a Counter Strike textbook at some point. That's when whenever we talk about the difference between a shallow and a wide peak. Still waiting for FaZe to really find the answer here. Well, here's a little bit of it. Molotov all the way towards top mid. Smoke towards top mid as well from FaZe. Going to allow Twist to get a position in lower dark. And ooh, missed shot from Rops. Twist is going to fall back, but Rops is in so much trouble. Here's the change of pace. Oh, trying to track. Good luck. Bless your heart. It's a nice attempt, but Twist and Kerry going to pull it back just a little bit. All the kills coming out for Navi after that. A stunning strike. They have lulled FaZe Clan into a sense of security with a slow style, and that is a devastating B hit. Oh, once you miss that shot, it's just, you're in trouble. By the way, I think Electronic is 14 and 2. 
that he landed. I mean, he would have died anyway, but... The one on the one rops of track hand? Yeah, like, it hits it the was box. At all. It hits the box in front, but I, I couldn't tell, like, if it was just, just on top or not. Wow. That's what seals it. Yeah, Kerrigan's life is so important. That Molotov is way too deep. They won't care. Electronic hurt that. Still gets clothesline. One for one trade. broki has got to address the situation, which leaves Rain on his own. 20 seconds on the clock. Yep. Nice shot from Broki. They need so much more. He's going to pick up bit as well. And that might be the shutdown right here. Not enough time, I think, for Navi once again. And Broki keeps going. Nice triple. And Simple's on his own. Oh, he gets one on Rops right there. Seven seconds on the clock. But this time, they can't even do it with kills. Go for the no scope. Oh, he hit him. One HP <laughs> left on Twist. No way. He no scoped him through the door. Quick scope, whatever you want to call it. Just one HP left on Twist. That's unfortunate. Bad play. Yeah, that's a lot on Brokey. Yeah. That kill out towards Long was everything. Allows him to completely turn and look over towards Catwalk and even towards CT spawn. Triple kill for Brokey. It's not too late. If they can get up to five, it could be something. Grenades through Rops, missing the shot. He couldn't see anything in that one. And coming through the door is Twist, <laughs> and they just go right back to that straight B hit, and it works just as well as last time. Eliminate any idea of a retake when you take a bomb site against the double op setup. Brokey's gonna find one kill. However, they're gonna try and chase him down, I would imagine, through the smoke. Rain's there for protection, but they want that op. Yep. Ooh, Rain's gonna get a couple there, but I'm not sure it helps that much. It's really the value of the AWP that we're talking about here. Bit is going to go down. I don't think they care so much, Navi, about throwing away some players. Oh, nice nade. Hold on, Rain. He got four kills at the end after having basically lost the round. Good reference. Ooh. Oh, no. P. Simple's going to take that <laughs> advantage all day. Yes, he will. And the problem is, do you even try and swing against this? Nice flashbang to set it up, and it could have been a beautiful double, but instead, it's just a lot of damage, and that might not be enough here. Trying to get it back, Rain. Anything it takes here. If they get a random shot for the smoke and kill someone, maybe they can go for the retake. But if not, yeah, some of the some of the angles that Robs has been holding kind of shows what he's expecting out of that fight. He, he feels like, well, I know, I know I'm close, but I hit the shot every time, right? I, I know I can do it. Even if you jump, I'm gonna, we're probably gonna, gonna flick and get the hit, but he just hasn't been able to. Sneaking through. I mean, the more info he can get, the better. Go knife. for the knife. No. Get yourself like just a That's little, up. a little bit of fun. Have a good time. There's the spray on one. Oop. Misses the chance. Simple coming back and he's getting shot at through the fire. Eventually, Simple going to be able to take him down. So, definitely not the most you could have had out of that, but maybe it'll rattle Navi just a little bit. Three versus three now. 50 seconds on the clock and bit oh through. What a position to take down Rain. Bomb is still outside of the B bomb site, and they have 40 seconds. Well, Electronic's just going to try and do his best to make sure nobody can rotate over. Perfecto Tang, the safest route, which is also the longest route out towards Long A. Here's a nice kill for Electronic. You imagine he gets this 9 out of 10 times. Oh, that's a good flashbang from Brokey, though. Yeah. Had admirable attempt. And obviously, this being the final round of the half, there's no point in saving anything. He's going to swing for it. We'll take down Electronic, but it cost him nearly everything, so... This will be a, a real challenge at the end. Does have a kit at the very least. Oh. Grenade's not going to help him. Yeah, there we go. Have to, have to throw it. Oh, seven damage, Shan. It's all done. What a first half for Navi. 13 to 2 in their favor. Just shut down in terms of ideas and creativity. They might get a little bit of a gift here. Looks like they wanted to get aggressive, but instead it's just going to be a stack. Yep, USP's on the other side, and overwhelmed is Electronic, but up in the window, Perfecto. Flo throwing some bullets into the bomb site. Bit on his own, and that might be enough. Simple landing a headshot as well on Twist. Nice double for Bit, and that holds it all back. They were here so quickly, Navi. Even if they only started with two people, in a matter of seconds, there was a third one in Perfecto in the window, and then it just kept going. It was two people B, two people mid, and Simple was on Catwalk. But I would say they definitely play a different game than what we're used to from Navi, so there's always that. Bit taking down Rain. And it's to be expected, Rookie. A little bit of a kill, good follow-up for the Deagle, and Robs is doing some work with the Tech-9. Realistically, Navi, I don't know if they have to go for this. I mean, they have such a long buffer that on the one end, you could say we could throw away the rifles, we're probably going to win the map anyway, but 
If you wanted to be 1 million percent sure, just save what you have here. Ooh, yeah, walking into it. So many angles to check. Rops will take down Sundai Young and simple. One versus three. We wanted to. Wanted to be the hero, but not today. No, tw uh, Twist helps FaZe stay alive a little bit longer. Here it comes. Oh, they're far, far away. And they got grenaded, and they've got rain in the lower dark just shooting off pop shots. So this idea of a flashbang over the mid doors is not going to yield them any results. FaZe is well defended against it. One player goes down. That should be it. Broki not able to land the kill. Kerrigan's going to find that for me. We're down to a nine-round lead. Fight a little bit here, and then they have a lot more of a say than they did in the first half. That part's already kind of been accomplished here. It's a good start. Not so much here for Rob. No way. Oh, and Pity gets away with more. Flashbang assist from Simple to set that one up. And it's going to be an execution kill coming in from Rain. Electronic did not realize. So a little bit of a chance to come back into this round here. What a scary situation. Kerrigan and Twist only have the one smoke to cross, though. That Molotov, they're going to try and use that as some cover. Simple, how much does he want to get aggressive behind it? Okay, there's the second smoke coming in. Wall completed, but it don't matter. Simple's got a blind kill through smoke. Three on two, and that's an all-important kill for Rain. No kit yet again. Yeah, no grenades either. Hearing the steps up there. Simple, he just needs a bit, and he tries to go for it. Takes down Twist. Now it's Rain on the other side. Has to do this on his own. Oh, out from long. He's very exposed. No, no way! Absolutely no way! He did not just do that. He didn't even react. Simple just showing him how it's done. This is a great shot. Great accuracy snapping over to Twist, but this is just silly. Flashbang is out. Yeah, take the risk, I guess. What the? <laughs> yeah, that's all you can do. Just laugh, put your head against the chair. Obviously, things just aren't going your way. I mean, that T-side was like a team win. Yeah, that was, was such wonderful calling from Electronic. Everyone had their time for some impact and some kills. Perfecto knows what's coming. Drops a smoke. Got a teammate here as well. It's going to be hard to handle. Perfecto sneaks in for another shot, and they still got a bit on this crossfire, and Electronic is making his way over. Every second passing, this is going to get worse for a phase to try and get into the bomb site, and they might have missed the opening already. Nice shot from Twist and Brokey. They're fighting back. They don't want to let go of this map just yet. And Simple, he might not be asking any longer. He might just take it away from them. Twist goes down. He was ready for that one. And now it's all on Brokey, switching it up for the AK-47, but he can't really stay, and he almost... He has to come up with some kind of a trick. One flash and he's dead. Trying to sneak through it. Simple taking him down. And it's a 16 to 6 victory for Na'Vi. An absolutely statement win to take down FaZe on the opening map of the series. Yeah, that is a crazy opening map to have. What a wonderful T side. 13 2. And then you just get to relax and take your time and close things out in the second half. Helped out, obviously. Simple comes in for the close. The jumping clutch on Rain. Obviously, a wonderful last round as well. But if you're FaZe. We'll see what they can bring in because they're facing elimination here in the playoffs already. A bit early for the number one team in the world. Yes, it is. Well, welcome to Inferno. Speaking of early? Yeah, Rumps. Another one of those. I didn't even see him. <laughs> <laughs> Just straight dead. Oh, oh! <laughs> oh he's, that's so unreasonable. <laughs> Get one more. One more one tap. Oh, he's trying, isn't he? He really wants it. But you can understand the idea. Just making sure there's no fast flank. Couple of missed shots now from Simple. And there we go. Another headshot. Make it a triple. And he finally goes down, but Bit is here to take over. And it's a fourth player in CT spawn. Not even needed this time around. Good defense. Good start to Inferno for Navi. Now the prospect of starting T-side on Inferno to keep your playoff dreams alive to stay alive in this quarterfinal series. They know the position of Rain. Dooleys are out. Good kill from Brokey, but so much attention taken over towards Rap side. Simple somehow manages an impossible situation again and again. Perfecto with those duelies. Out of library, gets the final kill. At the moment, stepping in front of the Rap side smoke. Perfect flashbang by himself, I believe. Rain gets the trade, but the B bomb site is under attack. Tight angle for Simple, but Rain crouches right into it. Huge opening right there. If Rain could have somehow even just stayed alive, it would have pulled Simple and sort of kept him over on this side of the map. But now they're ready. 25 seconds, trying to come through the smoke, but there's just so much defense on the other side here. Perfecto with a nice double kill, and Simple will take that headshot every single time. That is a, a very clean defense coming out right here. Okay, I'm worried. 
Tech Nines, this is gonna be a fast paced hit right off the back of utility usage. At some Da Young blind up on the balcony. Simple's got a blind kill and another one inside of the bomb site. He's eventually gonna get wrapped upon, but Electronics here for support. And again, no access whatsoever for FaZe. They get the one kill and that's it. Only six kills for FaZe in the first five rounds of this map. It's fine that Kerrigan slips the net because Simple's got enough kills to activate Electronic through the smoke to pull it right back. Rookie, does he want to go for the challenge? He tries, but Simple's on the other side. In many ways, larger than life himself, Jason. <laughs> well done. Thanks. I hate you. <laughs> Pit with the kill down banana as well. Simple again. Look at this defense. Two players of the A bomb said even with one picked off, no one's in any kind of a rush to rotate over towards A. Simple's all on his own as he's maintaining aggression. Three versus four. A lot of damage on. But Simple will take down Rain. Rock his body right. Stop it. You stop that right now. Simple maintaining aggression gets another one and That's an impossible kill to recover from for Simple. 25 seconds and he's just not getting any vision on anyone and he's he's pretty far out right now gonna be so confusing them why am i not seeing even anybody there's the look but it takes too long and electronic will take him down they could firebomb him out and that would be the real play yeah there we go down onto the bicycle some die young at least that smoke will give him a little bit of space to work with and he goes aggressive this is a smart move and he gets a headshot on rain on top and now ooh, they're so far away if they would have been closer, I mean, they're still going to try and run a little bit closer right now, but they are right behind him in the middle. And yeah, now he's thinking about it, comes back in, already scoped up, and even took a minute to get that one back for Pavecto. And now it's definitely done. So that was, a, from some youngest point of view, that's a really cool defense. And the fact that that smoke, that's a T-smoke that they mean they want to cross in and get the bomb down, but he uses it as a way uh -oh. to actually go and fight Electronic. Oh, surely no way. No way. He's going to go for it. Nope. They come back for him, and he's not going to win the round, but he did make it real expensive. It's going to transfer into the bomb site. Simple's going to get aggressive. Timing shot doesn't land. That's when the M4 swings out. He's trying to keep them at bay. Good nade from Simple as well, and Perfecto lying in wait. Yeah, back of the bomb site. He just has to stay alive and buy a little bit of time. Well, even better than that if he gets a kill on top, but he's the only one of the bomb site. So if he dies too quick, then those smokes are still going to be up and there could be a bomb pump behind it. Waiting inside, though. Perfecto is playing this rock solid at the moment. Nice triple frame here and simple flash. Doesn't even matter. He saw rocks beforehand. There's another good defense and another round where they had three. Yeah, just, just eye test of the way Navi is dominating this. All the right reads, all the right rotations, all the right utility usage and... I mean, just even after that, you're just winning the straight up duels. Yeah, they're not even falling back from that fight in the apartments. Like, yeah, we're just gonna stick around and, and keep the battle going. Oh, nice find from Kerrigan. Bomb, awkward position, but yeah, they have to worry about that while they're being pushed from the other side. Oh, nice Molotov, Kerrigan with a headshot. He's gonna have to do just a little bit more. Flash over. Some Dayak making a lot of noise running down. That's an easy shot for Kerrigan to hit, but does he realize Perfecto's already up? Crouching in! And he gets the headshot. It's a nice attempt. A triple kill for Kerrigan. Nearly three on five, two on five at one point when Simple and Some Dayang get, get finished with this. I think a two on five is the correct answer, as he's going to get a second kill right here. So Rain and Kerrigan almost pull it back, but that position from Some Dayang just keeps Kerrigan pinned down on the bomb site, keeps it so difficult from knowing what's coming next. And you're going to be walking into a stack. Perfecto already spotting them out. When they see him, though, they sh that should be a giveaway. But I don't know if they have time. They don't now. 20 seconds. They can't really backtrack easily to the B-bomb site. So even if they found out, it's not going to matter. Now they're walking into a trap right here. Oh, it's heartbreaking. Headshot comes through. Perfecto with a double. And it's all been shut down. Brokey. Nine seconds. And he cannot win the rounds. SDY taking him down. and Pulling out stacks at the right moment, but also the individual decisions. Perfecto. Having some attention out towards the rap side and just says, I'm falling into the bomb set. Electronic, watch my rap. You're in pit. You're doubled up. You have the new the new angle on that. And him and Sum Dai Young just set up a perfect crossfire. There's a good chance right here. Certainly going to be a lot of discussion around this uh, this phase team afterwards because not the first oh. sign of weakness that we've seen in the tournament. That's why they're in the quarterfinals to begin with. Oh, oh no, that can't be real. Smackdown. Roki and Kerrigan get blown up. Rops. <laughs> if you can't say it again, Jason. Oh my lord.
The nade strike in mid is so brutal. Rops left in a 1v4. <laughs> I, I don't really have words to describe it any longer. There goes Electronic, but Simple's here, and he hasn't been missing much this game. Yeah, that's one way to... Yeah, nice utility usage, exactly. That's the first. And the follow-up from Sum Dai Young. Absolutely perfect for a double. Devastating. I picked FaZe today as well. I need him to quit playing games with my heart. <laughs> so. Oh, thank God we're only doing one game today. <laughs> yeah. And he's going to go back for more. Surely he's not going to stop. Surely he just doesn't care. Oh, and it's a freebie. Close to the corner. <laughs> it's a no scope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, we're not laughing at face. This is so ridiculous. I'm laughing a little bit. At oh, why is he doing it? And uh, that would be annoying, wouldn't it? Harrigan running in. Oh, is they, are they going to try? It almost looks like Electronic was holding his trigger there. It will, in the end, be a, another round for Navi. 13 to 1. Navi just has all the right answers at the moment. Nothing's going wrong for him. Okay. A bit of a headshot. Yeah, this does seem like it's... Uh, so I have hard match to to maybe take too much away from other than the fact that Navi and Simple are looking red hot right now. He's smoking it off, looking for a bit more. No. He tried to do it again. He really tried, didn't he? I believed. I felt it. I thought it was coming. That would have been freakish. Tried for a little bit there. Rookie looking for anything again. I mean, he's playing this the right way. He wants to isolate it into a one-on-one, -on -one, but he just can't do it. Electronic will take him down. It is a 14 to one victory in the first half in favor of Navi. That is shocking. Although Electronic goes down at the beginning here, so we'll see if they can find a little bit more Kerrigan's out fighting. On Banana. Fit with a bit of a return. Perfect with a nice headshot as well. Oh my lord. Wow, they're chewing them up under. They're not even going to give them a chance to get into the second half. Brokey. Flash doesn't do that much, but it doesn't matter. Simple's out on the hunt, finding a second kill of the round. Rops down in the middle. Bomb is going to be planted, and even worse. Yeah, Perfecto is there to already spot him out, so not much he could do. I think this is how th this is how the the internet came up with the with the insult of people tryharding, right? Because if you can't win, at least you can at least you can say you well, can make them feel ashamed for being good. Yeah, at least I didn't try as much as you did. Yeah, at least I didn't invest more time. If you really want to win, then fine. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Take it, you rat. As <laughs> the Navi that's going to be on the stage tomorrow. Good luck. And I believe the winner of this plays OG. Uh, yeah, you might be right about that. I should probably confirm that before I say things out loud. Fine, just make it. Right. No one's. Gonna... Yes, the winner of this plays OG. I was right. Oh, wow. Nicely done. So, rematch for Navi from the Major and even before that, whose name is starting popping up more and more. Dexter standing in for Mantu in the OG lineup. Like, uh, let's see a Dexter versus Simple battle. Could be fun. 50 seconds now. Four versus three. And isolated in the bomb site, all on his own, fighting with the MP9. It's Rob's good double kill for him. It's not bad. By a little bit of time, Rain goes down, though. Teammates trying to get here, but it won't matter. 16 to 1. Navi, they send FaZe packing like it was nothing. They might have packed their bags for him. They're, FaZe came back to the hotel and realized all their stuff's in the lobby. It's ready to go now. Yeah, they, they did, in, like in one of those movies where they stuffed their bodies into the, into the luggage.